Nerlon Bizikov's Hesman stud is set in the beautiful surroundings of East Sussex. There has been a recent run of success for the operation, and we've travelled down to the stud to speak to Tony Fry to find out more about the operation, their plans going forward, and their success as an owner breeder. I think the same as most people. The, it's the best racing in the world. It's the prestige of the big meetings. Um, it's well run, and it's, it, was, it was a wonderful opportunity to, to, to make a start. He had horses, he had a few horses in training um, in the early days with Marcus Trigoni and Asker Tau for one. Um, and then when he invested in Hesmonds back in 2010, that was when it really took off the investment in the mares um, and up until today. Mm -hmm. I think it's the, the initial product. You've got to start with the right mares and then use the right stallions. So he went in at a, at a high level with the pedigrees um, and it's starting to pay off. So there was a lot of uh, financial investment to get, the, to get it rolling. Um, you know, some of the mares are still here, as you've seen, you know, like a mare like First, who's 21 years old now. She's still going for us and looks fantastic. Um, so it's, it was just a, a slow process. I think we started with six mares. We're now up to 28, um, which is getting to nearly too many. Um, so it's just, uh, it's just been a, organically, it's developed itself. By being an owner breeder, it gives you the luxury of not having to follow the crowd and use the commercial sires. We still use quicker sires and a bit of speed, but that's because it suits the mares. I think by being an owner breeder, you can always do what you feel is best for the mares. Buildings and the infrastructure is where we want it to be. Um, Mare-wise, you're always striving to improve. You know, we haven't achieved much yet compared to many of the many of the great farms around the world or in England, you know. Um, so we're getting there. It's still high hopes, but we haven't achieved as much as as we'd like to. You know, we're not going to settle for um, a Group Three winner or having a runner in the Oaks. It's nice to be there on the big days, but you know, you want to be there winning these races, not just taking part.